Democratic presidential nominee Vice President Kamala Harris released a letter from her doctor on Saturday, pronouncing her to be in good health and fit for the Oval Office. According to a Harris aide, the move was made to draw attention to Republican nominee Donald Trump's refusal to release his medical report. And it's just a further example of his lack of transparency. Harris spoke to reporters before boarding a plane to North Carolina. And it is clear to me that he and his team do not want the American people to really see what it is that he uh, is doing and whether or not he actually is fit to do the job of being president of the United States. In a memo distributed by the White House, Harris's doctor said her last physical exam in April was unremarkable and that she maintains an active lifestyle and a healthy diet. It noted she suffers from seasonal allergies and sporadic hives which have been well managed with medications and antihistamine treatment. In a statement, Trump's campaign communications director said that Trump has voluntarily released updates from his personal physician, as well as detailed reports from the medical doctor who treated him after the first assassination attempt. In 2018, when Trump was in office, a White House doctor said he was in overall excellent health, but needed to lose weight and start a daily exercise routine. The Harris campaign is eager to highlight the former president's age of 78, since he became the oldest candidate after 81-year-old President Joe Biden stepped aside from the race. The campaign hopes contrasting Harris's comparative youth and mental acuity with Trump's advanced age and tendency to meander will convince undecided voters that she is more fit for office.